Hello, my name is Stan Wooten. I would like to talk to you today about the Defense Red Switch Network, also known as DRSN. The DRSN provides the DOD with high quality secure voice telephone and conferencing services for end-to-end -end use by DOD authorized users. The DRSN include a range of assured services to C2 users and their mission in an environment of a robust and future-rich set of capability. This service provides major C2 facilities to include the National Military Command Center and Combat Command Headquarters with interconnection through a secure network. The DRCN used the digital small switch, the DSS2 Alpha Red switch, for multi-level secure calls and conferencing and used prominent equipment for time division multiplex transport. The prominent equipment is at end of life and end of service and requires a replacement transport. The DSS2 Alpha switch will provide a internet protocol interface connection to IP routers, which will interface with IP encryption for secure IP transport. What is on the horizon for this program will be to replace the end of life and end of service red prominent TDM transport network with an IP transport network at 45 different sites. Transition to multi-level secure voice users to enterprise classified VoIP service as well as upgrade the DSS2 Alpha switch with IP cards and new software for IP integration. The DRSN program has delivered innovative solutions by using a full life cycle methodology for initiation of this project. To close out, the DRSN IP solution undergoes rigorous tests and evaluation from the vendor, lab, and JITIC, and site testing for the program life cycle throughout deployment, implementation, and sustainment. This program is very important because it is the service of the core for DOD global secure force systems during peacetime, crisis, and time of conventional war by hosting national level conferences and connectivity requirements and provide interoperability with both DOD tactical and strategic community for major commands and VIP users. Looking to make things better for our mission partners, this transition of the DRSN from TDM transport to IP with enhanced capability to include capacity, security, scalability, with the ability to support higher call volume and improve functionality. This will provide call efficiency by eliminating the need to support TDM technology. Moving to an IP-based infrastructure will provide a more resilient and secure network, provide higher quality of service, fear of network disruption, and an environment that is easy to operate and defend the nuclear command, control, and communication, NC3 and NC2 communities of interest. Thank you for providing me with the opportunity to talk to you about our program.